guys, it's your girl Samantha, aka Lovely Symbols Life, and I'm back with another video. Uh, as always, make sure you subscribe. Always give my videos a thumbs up and never hesitate to comment down below. So I had a gentleman think that subscribing to YouTube channels cost. Well, guess what? It doesn't. It doesn't. Subscribing to my YouTube channel costs absolutely nothing, so be sure to subscribe. If you are new here, thank you for joining and giving me a chance, and I hope you are here for the long haul. Yeah, with that being said, um, I am going to be sharing with you guys my top 10 favorite random things, must-haves, uh, things that I can't live without, uh, whatever category it may fall under. Uh, that is what I'm going to be sharing with you guys today. I hope that you guys do comment down below and let me know what are some of your favorite things or if you have any questions about my favorite things. I hope that you can find some of my favorite things uh, useful <laughs> or funny or entertaining, whatever. So um, comment down below during the video some of your favorite things or your go-tos or your can't live without or must haves, all that good stuff. Um, I wanna know, put me on to some stuff. Put me on, okay? I'm always down to like try new things and all that good stuff. All right guys, so without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay guys, so first on my uh, list of top 10 favorite random things that I can't live without or you know, must have, all that good stuff. Witch Hazel, guys, I live by, this is a, something that I live by. I can't live without it. I live by Witch Hazel. This is just a small bottle that I got from the Dollar Tree, um, but they have them in larger bottles. Um, I just load up on them at uh, Dollar Tree, literally better than any like antibacterial ointment, neosporins, um, aftershave, it's the best. I live by it. It's better than rubbing alcohol. It doesn't burn. Um, I started using this when I was 18. Um, my first week of being a stripper, I had what we call strawberries all over my legs from um, being a new dancer. Uh, scrapes and bruises all over my legs. Strippers, you know what I'm talking about. And I was told to put witch hazel on my legs and ever since then I've been hooked on it. It works wonders, it's the best, Better, it's just the best for blemishes, after you shave, razor burn, rashes, uh, this is the shit, it's the shit, okay? Witch Hazel, I live by Witch Hazel. It's a go-to, I can't live without it, I won't live without it, gotta have it, yes. Next on the list, cap stick. I know a lot of people are like, oh, okay, a lot of people, you know, have to have chapstick or just need chapstick. No, literally, if I don't have chapstick or moisture on my lips, I'll have a whole panic attack. Like the thought, oh, the thought of my lips being dry, I can't. Like I will literally will have a panic attack. Like I, I can't live without this. I cannot live without chapstick or any kind of moisture. I prefer this kind of chapstick. Um, I'll take any kind if my lips are that dry and crusty feeling. And um, yeah, got to have it. Like I cannot be feeling, it's just the thought of that feeling. Like I cannot. Um, I remember when I was a small girl, my mom used to send a thing of Vaseline in my backpack to school with me because I, I couldn't stop licking my lips I hated the feeling of them being dry. So yes, chapstick is a, I can't live without it. Literally, I can't live without it. If I don't have it, I'm gonna go into a full blown panic attack. Chapstick, gotta have it. Okay guys, so next on my list, I have more of a household uh, favorite that just makes me happy. I'm a smeller, you know, scents bring me joy so literally i love my tea light candle I use to burn my wax and fragrance oils i love the smell of the fragrance oils 
I live by Fresh Linen. Um, I also love lavender. I love the eucalyptus. Um, uh, just all types of fresh waxes and oils to make my home smell good. And sometimes candles can be a bit potent and like, I don't know, they make me a little nasally. Depending on what mood I'm in, uh, sometimes I use a lavender at nighttime to help me relax. I like eucalyptus, which is very, very invigorating to start my day. Anytime one of my tea lights go out, I'll light another one. I just love that freshness that it gives um, from the oil and the wax. So yes, this is a go-to favorite of mine in my home. I love my wax oil burners. So yeah, I love it. I gotta have it. You should try it. I love them. Moving on. Next. Okay guys, so on to uh, um, something that's also in the household department of Smell Goods, uh, Fabuloso. Okay, but not just any Fabuloso. It has to be the refreshing lemon. I love this smell, you guys. I love this smell to wipe my counters down, to mop my floors. I love it. And and also, I have a potpourri pot that I put it in with my potpourri. Yep, I do. I know potpourri pots are kind of old fashioned, but guess what? Kind of old fashioned. So yes, I love, 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 love. This is a current favorite of mine. Um, that I just, I just love it. I just love the smell of it. That lemon, like, it gives me life. Yeah, they just it just gives me life. And they're only one dollar. This costs one dollar at the Dollar Tree. Can't beat it. Can't beat it with a stick. So yes, I love me some lemon fabuloso guys. Okay guys, this one is almost an I can't live without these days. The Swiffer mop, you guys. But I love the wood, the wet jet for wood Swiffer. Yeah, I can't live without it. I love it. And you gotta have your Swiffer wet mopping cloth, the shiznit. It's just so convenient, especially now that I have a three-year-old boy that kind of peepees around the potty instead of in the potty. When he's aiming, yeah, it works wonders. Getting getting all up in those cracks and crevices beside my toilets. So yes, I love the Swiffer wood for wood floors though. It has my wood floors shining like new money. I love it. I, I couldn't imagine like a mop and a bucket. No, but yeah, I enjoy the Swiffer. Shout out to Swiffer. You got me. Okay, guys, so next on the list, hot sauce. I can't live without it. It's a can't live without. I love me some hot sauce. Mm -hmm. I love hot sauce. Spice, hot sauce, spicy. I have to have it. It makes me happy. Um, if my food isn't a little bit spicy, I probably won't enjoy it as much. So yes, I am a hot sauce lover. All the hot sauce a woman can have, she's gonna have. I ate all of the Louisiana hot sauce, so don't worry. She was in the mix too. Um, but yes, hot sauce and spices are, I can't live without them. I can't live without my food not being a little bit on the spicy side. <laughs> Cause I'm spicy. <laughs> anyway, so yes, hot sauce lovers, comment down below if you are a spicy food lover. Some people are, and some people aren't. So let me know if you are. Yes, I love hot sauce. All right, guys. Since we're kind of in the food department, mmm, mmm, -hmm. mmm, -hmm. it's a favorite. It's a can't live without. I love pickles. I always have since I was a little girl. Anybody that knows me knows that Samantha loves 
pickles. Like a pickle a day keeps the doctor away for me. I'm a pickle head, always have been. These are some really good pickles that I got from the Dollar Tree. Like all pickles, honey, like don't play. Don't play with me and my pickles. Like I do not play about my pickles. But yes, I love pickles. Yes, I love pickles. I'm a pickle head. I'm a pickle connoisseur. I might turn into a pickle one day. Anyway, next. <laughs> okay guys, so next is my air fryer. I love the air fryer. I do not enjoy cooking fried foods in my kitchen, on my stove, the whole grease mess, just, it just doesn't do it for me. Uh, do I love fried foods? Yes. Do I like cooking fried foods? No. So the air fryer is perfect for me. Um, yeah, and I can cook some fried chicken in there. Yeah, I hooks it up, you know. Yeah, I think I'm hungry now. <laughs> With all this food and stuff. Yes, I love my air fryer. It's so convenient, it's efficient. And it is mess free. I am queen of mess free. So the air fryer made the list. Another one of my favorite um, go-to things is YouTube. I love YouTube, clearly. <laughs> but no, literally, I love YouTube. I watch YouTube like it's cable. Some people watch Hulu or you know all these other apps like uh, channel apps and all that good stuff i go straight to youtube when i wake up in the morning youtube um i watch everything on youtube i love youtube youtube you should send me a check soon <laughs> so that's why you guys should subscribe to me because i do love youtube and um i like interacting with you guys and Shout out to YouTube um, for giving me this platform to do what I love. I love to entertain. I love to share. I love to help. I love to be vulnerable and um, give people a, an insight into my life because I'm shameless. You know, um, the older I've gotten, I've become shameless. I refuse to live my life with shame and regret and I've accepted the fact that I am human you know and YouTube allows me to project that into the universe and to people that I know and to strangers so shout out to YouTube you are definitely a favorite of mine okay guys and so for my um last random thing on my list it's not very random. It's not random at all, matter of fact. Um, and I cannot live without him. My son, Ryder. Um, he is far from random. I cannot live without him. He is a must-have. He is a go-to. He is a favorite of mine. And he, he is just the best. So I put him on my list. Um, and really, he's my most favorite, can't live without, go-to, must-have. So, I love you, Ryder. Mommy loves you. You're asleep right now, but you're my must-have, go-to, can't live without, forever and ever and ever. All right, guys. So, that will wrap up my top 10 favorite random things, must-haves, things that I can't live without. My go-tos, my current favorite things. You get what I'm saying. I hope you enjoyed. Comment down below some of your go-tos or current favorite things or, or household things, uh, foods, all that good stuff that you just like and just the little things that may make you happy in life because all of these little things make me so happy. They bring me joy, okay? You get to a certain age you know, it's just the little things that make you happy. And it's kind of cool. But all right, guys. Well, thank you for watching. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Um, hit that ding bell so you get all of my videos when they are uploaded. And please subscribe, guys. It's 
free. Support your girl. Okay? Subscribe, 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 subscribe. I love you all. Bye.